prophets in the Old Testament said to the people of Israel, A voice of one calling in the wilderness, Prepare the way for the Lord. But the words were forgotten by the people, and then suddenly one day, shouts began to be heard in the desolate wilderness again. They were the cries of John. He was crying for people to make way in the wilderness, where no roads can be found. The Gospel begins with a story about John's father, Zechariah, who was a priest. The priest was someone who conveyed God's forgiveness and mercy to people through sacrifice. People loved the priest who took away their sins and blessed them. They were popular with people, but not anyone could be a priest. Zechariah gave birth to John at an old age, and John had to follow his father's footsteps and become a priest. At that time, it was only natural that a son would take over his father's occupation. Moreover, a priest was a stable position of authority, popular with people, so there was no reason for John not to take over his father's position. But John did not do so. He turned away from the easy way of priesthood and went on the hard path as a prophet. People didn't like prophets because they normally told people things like, you're living a wrong life, turn away from your wrong ways and repent. If you don't, God will punish you. But that's not what John did. He went out into the wilderness in search of God's words, dressed in camel fur and eating grasshoppers and wild honey. John heard God's words and spread them repeatedly. Repent, the kingdom of God is close. The powerful people didn't like John because he was always telling them things they didn't want to hear. But the Israelites came out to the wilderness to meet John, who chose to become a prophet and not a priest. Perhaps it was because they thought that there would be something different about John, perhaps because John was doing something that no one else was doing. People met John and got baptized, vowing to change their lives. So John became John the Baptist and not John the Priest. John the Baptist prepared a way, a new way in the desert, and on that way, Jesus came. Luke chapter 3 tells us that King Herod hated John the Baptist so much that he kept him in prison and killed him. And when John the Baptist died, his cries in the wilderness to prepare a way for the Lord seemed to disappear from the world also. But did you know that the Bible is waiting for those who shout out like John the Baptist? Today, God is still waiting for someone to prepare a new way in the nothingness of wilderness. He is waiting for people who walk not in the easy way where everyone goes, but in the way of the Lord and His words. Thank you.